as long as we're on the subject, I should note that Mother 3 is kind of going to be on hold for a while because, as you all know, I will be going to college soon. That's disgruntling for me. Yes. And, well, I don't plan on taking my N64. So, I need to finish Donkey Kong 64, at least recording the gameplay, before the summer's over, whereas Mother 3 I'm emulating, and that can go on my laptop. So I have as long as I need to finish that, which is why it's going on hold. To focus on more immediate concerns for Let's Playing. If I don't finish Donkey Kong 64 by the end of the summer, it's gonna go on a one- it's gonna go on a nine month hiatus. That's really all I can do. I really am not bringing my N64. Unless someone wants to play the game to the point where I am in an emulator and give me the save state, in which case, sure. If you're that if, faithful... If you really want me to finish it that bad, not only will I finish it for you, I will give you a shout-out and try to coerce some of my 778 subscribers over to your channel. So, if you want instant fame and to be loved and adored by all, and if I'm not done with Donkey Kong 64 by the time I leave, you have a shot at some cheap success here. So, there you go. Heh, <laughs> 69. Really? Yes, really. Did we say that like 60 times yesterday? We probably said it 69 times. Probably. Back in the summer of 69. Not talking about the year. No, that song is not talking about the year. Songfacts.com tells you a lot of things. Mr. Bucket? A uh, Mr. Bucket? Why are we referencing that? I don't know. So, Angry Video Game Nerd, that guy's funny. Yeah, pretty much. Why are we so ADD in this? Welcome to my world. I was gonna let's play this by myself before I knew you. It would have sucked. Yeah, because you wouldn't have had my fine good looks and my sexy voice to help you. Sure, John. Your fine good looks and your sexy voice. Your non-existent sexy voice. <laughs> and your non-existent good looks. Just kidding. Don't make me break up with you on the internet. On a Let's Play, with 700 people knowing it. You might stoop lower than Ian. I wouldn't do that. I won't dump you for Halo. Wouldn't it be funny if he watched this? I don't think Ian's that nerdy anymore. He's on the football team. He's cooler than us. Not really. Uh, I've seen some pretty darn nerdy people. Jeff. Let's... Well, no one you people will have heard of, but let's, let's not name names. Right. Basically, we have a nerd clique at my school, a very large nerd clique, or at least we did, until 90% of it graduated, but that's not my school anymore. It's I'm my school still for one more year. Have fun with seven bells a day. <sighs> Actually, you know what? You I'm sure... Releasing me. Best dragon in the game. Anyway, though, honestly, I'm sure of my 778 subscribers... This is purely for ratio purposes, because I'm, sure I'm sure not all of you are still in high school. In fact, I can guarantee it. But let's say if all 778 of you were in high school, probably 600 of you would be on a 7-bell schedule. So, Yeah, I'm going to miss that schedule, the four periods a day. That was nice. Yeah. I don't know why they had to go and change that. So they could fire half the teachers. Which is unfortunate. A lot of my favorite teachers got fired. Poor Mr. Stewart. Uh, that, He's not really my favorite. That would be the opposite of good. I can't believe we're making fun of real life things in this Let's Play. Okay, all, all of my viewers, you have full permission to turn this off whenever you want. Because I'm sure you really don't want to hear about our real life life. But if you do, then wow. You, you sick, sick, sadistic bastards, you. You cuss in a Let's Play. Have you ever done that before? Um, only when I get really angry. I've never- I don't think I've ever dropped the F-bomb. Now watch, someone will watch every single one of my videos and find one instance where it accidentally slipped out. Although, actually, I really don't think that's happened. I welcome a challenge. If I have ever dropped the F-bomb, please prove it to me. Because honestly, I don't even know anymore. Yeah, audio glitch. It's gonna be pretty bad when that happens, although I'm sure we're gonna stop to eat after this level. 
Right. It's pretty, getting pretty late. Of course, no, none of you guys will know that, because either we'll split the part, or we'll start a new session of recording the, narr the narration, and it'll just fit together seamlessly, and you'll never even know. Funny how post-commentary works like that, how I can just, you know, stop, and no one knows. It's beautiful. And break the chests, and is that... Nope, you missed a blue. Right. And I know where it is now. Which is unfortunate. But you had to go through the whole level again anyway to show off another secret that no five-year-old is going to think of, but you'll see that very soon. Yeah, you don't read a game E and then put in the most ridiculous challenges in the world. Well, I mean, E just means that it won't twist a little kid's mind. It doesn't necessarily mean it's the appropriate difficulty. I don't know. I think a little five-year-old might say, oh, I wish I was a purple dragon, and then go ram. In fact, my brother played this game, rammed me with his head for the next five days. I'm not even joking. But does he play Grand Theft Auto and then go beat hookers with baseball bats? He might as well. My brother gets a pretty bad attitude when he plays Grand Theft Auto. There it is. There's the gem. I don't. But he does. Yeah, Grand Theft Auto. I don't think it. I don't think it makes people more likely to be violent. I think it helps them. It gives them an outlet to to express their anger. Okay, most ridiculous secret ever, right here. What little kid thinks of this? No, the most ridiculous secrets are in the Dream Weavers. But True. yeah, my brother. You've seen how he is when we walk in his room and he's sitting there playing Combat Arms or Counter Strike or World of Warcraft. He gets angry. Well, none of you guys have seen it, but I have. But anyway. I think some food is in order, so we will pick up our commentary later, although for you guys, that'll be like, what, no time at all? It'll just kind of happen, so yeah, BRB. See you later. Okay, we are back. That didn't take long, or did it? You don't know. Or you are on the internet. It's a mystery. Ooh.